Look, it's 2002. You're playing the recently released game, Super Smash Bros. Melee, for the Nintendo GameCube. And your friend, Rob, has the audacity to say that he knows about a cool trick. You're suspect of this guy already, because the last cool trick he told you involved getting 20 KOs in Cruel Melee and unlocking Sonic. But you bite. Yeah, it's called Mad Dashing. I invented it myself. You jump into the air, but you air dodge directionally down really quickly. It gives you a little boost, so you can do a smash or regular attack out of a run. If you're the average person, the first thing you think to yourself is, Wow, that sounds useless. You weren't alone. When the phrase got more popularity, and was dubbed, The Wave Dash, the Smashboard's thread had similar sentiments. Wow, wave dashing is pretty hard to do quickly, all the way across the level. I think I'll stick to running. I agree, it's kind of useless. I agree with every that dislikes wave dashing. It's strange, and a terrible addition to the world that is melee. So look, we know what a wave dash is. You jump, and then you do an air dodge down real quick. You do a little slide, it's nice. Let's talk strategy. If this is you, you're thinking to yourself, Gee, I'm stupid. How do I use a wave dash? Let me tell you. Alright, if you're a learned man like myself, you're gonna recognize this clip from the Smash documentary. This, of course, is legendary player Ken versus some schmuck named Chillin' Dude 829. You may be asking yourself, well, Verb, you just said it yourself. I mean, this guy's a schmuck. How's he gonna be Ken? Hey, remember this move? Yeah, I call that a wave dash, baby. There you go, wave dash number one. People start knowing that you shouldn't cloud dodge against dogs. All right, so we're gonna skip ahead a couple of years here. Now we're talking big money, all right? We got Wizrub versus Ginger, Grand Finals. So look, you, you're probably thinking, well, wait, wave dashing? Isn't there new tech now? I mean, you got V cancels, and you got your ISIS frames, and you got super wave dashing, and I mean, that's just a better wave dash. But look, look at this guy Wizrobe, all right? He throws you, and then he does a wave dash. He wave dashes, and look, Ginger, I mean, he's just, he can't recover from that one. There's a special technique you can do here. Wow. This part of the video isn't very good. Hey, how about instead of watching it, you subscribe to me on YouTube and like this video. Okay, bye. I uh, use it for whatever, I don't know. So this is the last technique we're gonna go over in this video. If you're a real self-loathing bastard, and you're looking for a way to display dominance over your six-year-old cousin, who is so good at video games, I got a real treat for you. This one is the Wave Shine, baby. What you're gonna do is pick a stage with a walk-off. I picked Yoshi's Island. Your six-year-old cousin doesn't know that it's not legal, so don't worry about it. What a strategy this is. Your cousin is not gonna know how to deal with this one. Be warned, last time I did this, my cousin, he started crying. I had to deal with his mother afterwards. It wasn't pretty. There you go. That's Wave Dash. Look, it's not rocket science. You jump, you air dodge, and you know who else wave dashes? Mango. This is my first video. Like it, and please subscribe to me so I can make money. Also, follow me on Twitter, at VerbSSB. You can do it. I believe in you.